have Android 13 for Redmi 7 and Redmi Y3 as well. Uh, previously, I had some builds, but I didn't do any review. Uh, this is the first time I'm doing review of Android 13, and gradually you guys will get more videos on it. And so, first of all, I just want to show you how we can install any Android 13 ROM and how you guys can root it. So I already booted my device into recovery and then of course go to web section and select Dalby data cache system and vendor and then of course swipe to Y and then go to format data and type yes and you are done. Then navigate to the folder so I have ROS here which is vanilla built and you need to install G apps separately so here is the G apps which is Nick Gap score so ROM is flashing here ROM has been flashed and now G apps flashing so already done you guys already watched the installation process now i'm going to do a short review of aero os android 13 for redmi 7 and redmi y3 so this is gonna be the first impression and uh, not full review so let's see should we use that rom or not um, first of all if you ask me about the smoothness then blindly i can say this is just amazing next level smoothness is here in android 13 and this is vanilla built i am using a nick gaps here now let's we'll see what's in about section here is the android 13 and vanilla unofficial of course uh, air voice and lineage os kernel has been used here and let us security update and this is Under 13 of course and you guys can change that colors this is the Star egg of Android 13 but everything is fine here but I didn't find the uh, fingerprint here and other things are available and this is now in OSP mode that means a very initial stage so you guys will not get extra customizations and uh, airways always just like uh, uh, very very close to pixel experience room but we have device settings like headphone gain and microphone gain and uh, MI sound enhancer so that you guys can get better uh, sound quality and thermal profiles and jitter test and which is available and this is really really amazing and lineage os kernel always really buttery smooth so that's why we are getting better performance so this is the thermal profiles you guys can select according to choice and display color calibration which is the extra customization you guys can see only in device settings and then we have your the security but we don't have any other options like face unlock and fingerprint only i found here the uh, pin locks and other locks pin pattern and these things and now swipe pattern and pin that's it and password nothing more is available right now so this is a bummer so for most of the people will not able to use that and this is the accessibility as usual you guys already know about that and wallpaper and styles direct theme and themed icons upgrade and other things are available only one main wallpaper is available in ROS then we have the display settings as usual uh, what we have in previous builds like Android 12 so this is natural color boost and green strength blue strength red strength then we have display size and text night light and auto rotate the screen ambient uh, display and other things everything is fine rather than the fingerprint if you uh, don't need any fingerprint option so you can easily use that room no problem with that and other things and there is nothing to show actually nothing just a very simple op operating system 
pure android experience you guys will get pure just pure android experience and nothing more and this is as usual of course the pixel launcher is here and all app themed icons if you need that you guys can enable when you use the themed icons and this is the control center and which is from of course uh, as it is now in uh, initial stage so we have the a dark screen in control center in the background and we don't have a separate toggle for other things like data connection and other things but we have a uh, different toggle for Wi-Fi connection actually uh, the necessary customizations are available only a few not so much and these applications are available by default you guys will get google camera go and here is the calendar and here is the calculator of course and these are the things we have uh, in that room to show so that's all hope you guys understand everything and if you want something more then of course uh, if you have the fingerprint option in your device uh, if you tried this room then of course let me know in the comment section below so thank you for watching